All right, some good news. If you're one of Elon Musk's nine kids, data is uh, pretty chill when it comes to reacting to his own creations disappointing him. Case in point, Elon's reaction to a SpaceX rocket bursting into flames during a ground test firing Monday, his reaction was this. Yeah, actually, not good. Now you get my point, don't you, Sean? I got it. All right, so this could complicate Elon's plans for launching the Starship into orbit this year. Uh, on the complete opposite end of the spectrum, though, NASA's James Webb Telescope, giving the world our deepest and sharpest look at the distant universe. President Biden, Vice President Harris, and NASA have been rolling out these images you're looking at on your screen right now since Monday, and they have been spectacular, Rochelle, each one kind of unlocking its own mystery about the universe. It's just been wonderful to see. I mean, I think it just, it makes you feel very small when, when you consider just how much we still don't know about the universe. And I think when you consider some of these early pictures that we had with the Hubble telescope versus what we're seeing now with this James Webb Deep Space Telescope, I mean, it, it, it looks unreal. It looks like something you'd see on Avatar. The, the crispness and the detail of something that is billions of years away, I think, I find it incredible. I feel very, I feel very humbled by it. Yeah, it is incredible. I mean, it shows the creation of stars. I'm not even a space science, huge fan geek, but it's really, really cool looking at these images and really what this means for the future of space, for the future of, uh, I guess, just science and astronomy here going forward and what we could learn about everything that has happened in the past, I think is very exciting. And is there life out there? Let's, That's let's be honest, there, know. there certainly are questions about if in fact we'll discover signs of life somewhere out there in the universe. 13 billion light years, some of these images are that far away and essentially the equivalent of a grain of sand at arm's length and yet we're seeing spectacular images of them via infrared light. This telescope, a bit controversial, tens of billions of dollars over cost, decades late, but now it kind of feels like, okay, I get it, yeah. it paid off. Certainly. We're understanding the, the universe a little bit better. And I think maybe people who perhaps weren't interested in space travel, perhaps now that you see that there's a lot more out there to see, maybe, maybe. you know, I mean, I'd be interested in going.